Hello, my friends. Welcome to the Colgate Rochester Crozier Divinity School. This is the oldest Baptist seminary in the nation and one that has a rich, rich history. Uh, I've been fortunate to be here for a part of that history and, uh, and really looking forward to telling you something about it. In the meantime, after I've told you about our wonderful school, I hope that if you feel that it's a place for you, that you'll come and visit. This school has a tremendous history. Uh, it was the result of the merger of two seminaries in the early part of the 20th century. And uh, these two seminaries were brought together uh, under the uh, influence of a uh, wealthy patron and benefactor, John D. Rockefeller. And uh, this school has been built with wonderful craftsmanship uh, and it's a wonderful place to be. Uh, it has also been a place where significant things have happened in the life of the churches of America. Uh, there are some names that you might recognize when you come and some that you don't. Uh, but it's still a, a great place uh, to study and to find out what God has intended for your life. My name is Dr. James Evans, and I teach systematic theology here at the Divinity School and look forward to having a chance to talk with you. Uh, so if you have the opportunity, come visit us, and uh, we'll have a chance to sit down and talk. I started teaching here 30 years ago. Uh, I was uh, right out of graduate school, and I can tell you this story because I've told it many times before. And that is that as I looked at the places where I wanted to teach, uh, no place fit what I wanted to do with my career better than Colgate Rochester Crozier Divinity School. And so I was fortunate enough to be asked to teach here. And after a short period as a visiting uh, instructor, uh, I was invited by the president uh, to come and to join the faculty full time. I've been here ever since and have served in a variety of capacities. Uh, served as a professor, dean of black church studies, and served for 10 years as president of the institution. In the last 10 years, I've been uh, returned to the faculty and uh, have been very active in a number of ways in life of our community as a whole. Um, uh, my field, as I said, is systematic theology, and uh, I really enjoy teaching and writing in that field. This is uh, a really unusual place because once people come here and have their lives touched by this place, they never forget it. Uh, I've had the opportunity of having conversations with people who were married on this campus uh, as many as 60 years ago, and they still come back and they can go to the exact place uh, where they held their wedding ceremony. And uh, so this place has a real significant impact. Uh, this school has produced great preachers. This school has produced great missionaries. This school has produced great teachers, scholars, and professors. This school has produced persons who work in our denominational offices. This school has produced persons who serve as counselors and therapists. And this school continues to produce a, a number of bright, talented, and effective ministers. And I'm sure that if you are wrestling with a call to ministry, uh, you need to give this place a look. It is really a wonderful place to be and a wonderful place to work.